wired. Hello everyone, this is Axel from MobileSource.com and today we're at CES Las Vegas and we're having a look at the Xperia Z, ZL, sorry, ZL, uh, which is kind of a variant of the Z. Um, let's have a look at the specs first. So it has a 5 inches mega um, screen, sorry, reality display with mobile, mobile Bravi Engine 2. Uh, with a full HD resolution, it has a 13 megapixel camera with Exmor Air or S or S, sorry, uh, which can uh, which can capture uh, also HDR in both picture for both pictures and video, which is kind of funny. Uh, we'll look at that uh, during the review. Uh, he has a 2 megapixel front front facing camera and a quad core processor with 2 gig of RAM. RAM 16 gig of memory and a micro SD slot. So that's uh, that's pretty interesting. And what are the main differences between the S, uh, the sorry, the Z and the ZL? Well, first thing is that this one is not IP certified. It's not water resistant or not uh, or uh, dust resistant. Uh, it doesn't have the glass panel on the back. And it's a bit uh, smaller than the Z, but the, 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 the screen is the same size, so that's fine. Okay, so let's have a look at the, at the design. So here we can see a few, uh, there's the front camera here, I believe. Yeah. And there you don't have, oh, you get a little uh, notification LED, which I, uh, I haven't seen yet, but it's, it's kind of funny. And um, you have the touchscreen buttons on the on the, on the on the zone of the device. You also have the volume button here, the on-off button there, which is kind of neat because you can use it quite easily. You got that's a good thing. You get the dedicated button, camera button on on the on this side, which you didn't have, which you don't have on the Z. Which enables you to launch the uh, the camera pretty uh, pretty quickly. And uh, on the top, you get the jack, the micro SD, a micro USB here, and here you get you get a little drawer or something like this with the micro SD slots and the SIM slot. Here we go. In the back cover is uh, so it's not glass; it's plastic, but it's it's soft touch. It's, it's quite nice. And uh, on the black version, it has a little you know pattern on it, so it makes it a little different. So it's a question of taste. Taste here, uh, and the camera is right there. Here you can display the music player, access the camera, take a picture quite fast, you know, that's nice. And basically it's like the Z, but uh, with a different design and specs that are a little different because the size of the device is a little bit smaller. So basically it's, it's mostly a design, uh, uh, the, the differences between the Z and the Z. Z, uh, ZL mostly design wise and uh, for the rest it's it's quite similar so you ha you have Android Jelly Bean with a uh, new UI which is kind of kind of cool kind of cool looks a lot like uh, oops the last one but with uh, with different widgets and stuff like this with different interface is interfaces here for instance the widgets apps, wallpapers, themes, change the theme, let's put this one, you can access the, the dialer, contacts, multitask is pretty nice with uh, this, uh, this UI, and you also have those small apps, they call that small apps, so uh, yeah small apps and you can display them like this and put them whatever wherever you want that's pretty cool the main menu with um, the different sorting options and a few apps of course you have 
Let's look the albums, I guess, the zooming options. It's pretty cool. Works well, works really well. You've got Google now, but there's no network connection right now. Uh, you've got the movies. Absolutely. So Play Memories is a really great software and service suite that we have for all our digital imaging products. And you're also shipped with our wire products. That screen itself is, is really good. It's really good. So for the videos, you'll be enjoying those quite a lot, I believe. Uh, you've got the compatibility with PlayStation Mobile. You get the reader. Uh, you've got the Walkman, which is the latest version of the. Uh, the music player on the on those phones it looks a lot like the one you can find on the uh, Ion or the Xperia S running Android for ICS. It's pretty good. That's it. Basically, that's all we can say today uh, concerning the Xperia ZL. It's a nice device. I, I have a little preference for the Z because of the design, which is a little more premium. Premium. But this one is really good too, so I'm looking forward to reviewing it. See you later.